Mr. Goodplums, welcome back to my channel. Hey guys, it's been a while, but I am back. I have been under the weather, so I couldn't put any video up, but we are back and we are going to do another review video on the channel. And once again, I have partnered up with Hippie Crafter to do a review for them. And this time we're gonna review their Maca Potter. Now I've been wanting to review in their Maca Potter for quite a lot because of all the amazing review that I've seen on Amazon. And I wanted to see what's all the hype was about so i received the uh the box of makeup powder from them and inside the box they have 24 different shade of colors and uh, you know typical ev crafter uh design on the box beautiful i love the, the 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 colorful design of the box and on the back of the box he gave you all the information that you need to know direction how to use the uh, makeup powder with epoxy if you're doing soap or if you're doing candles you also have like some statement now uh, you know what uh, you can expect from them like it's a really and vibrant in color it's fade resistant and it's blendable all this good stuff but once we go ahead and open the box this is what inside the box look like you can see you have like a little bit of a little bit of um a coupon code inside for you to use uh i guess uh, with the epoxy which is a nice uh, touch we all know how epoxy is very expensive so that's a very low nice touch with them and i also did a review for the epoxy before so if you're interested to see how the epoxy stand up you could you can go ahead and click on the video right there but back to this video now the mica powder um they have come in uh, those jars and i think they're like 33 ml 0.33 ml so they have a lot of uh good um you know a good amount inside uh, the little jar and also one of the things that i really like about it is because the the whole 24 uh, jar came inside a plastic seal inside a plastic bag uh inside the box so this way if you have like any you know accident while being in shipping you don't have a giant mess because they are inside of the plastic but as you can see even inside of the plastic when i pull up the jar you still have a little bit of powder uh outside of the jar but it's nice and still and i was so excited to just go ahead and do some swatches with the colors in because when i opened the jar i was presently surprised how beautiful the colors would look like i love this uh, color and this is the color i I think this is the color uh, graphite and it's a beautiful charcoal uh, color with and one of the thing that I want to mention is that all their color have like that uh, that pearl that pearl crush in it which is make it so beautiful and so vibrant and so shiny now they have like different shade of colors now um, some of the colors like the blues and the purple and the red have like like different shade of them but you can easily uh, differentiate um, between the shades shades of color and also they have like some fun very fun color like this beautiful like green grass color and uh, I have found some very very beautiful color now throughout with the uh, swatches I found out all the uh, formula for the uh, each the different of the jar of the micro powder colors they were all consistent but this one is a uh, very very extra fine um um the the formula itself i'm not sure if it's a different formula but it doesn't take out from the uh, smoothness and the um, beautiful silk color of it and this is the color silk white but uh it's the only one that is super 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 fine but the other one they all are uh, consistent in formula and also as um, i'm showing you right now the jar itself it's pack full and a little bit goes a long way guys this color i was most excited to try because it's such a beautiful deep like maroon uh kind of red color and this is the color wine it's so beautiful and you can see guys just from the jar and doing some swatches i feel like i was like um one of the makeup go on <laughs> YouTube but uh, it's beautiful the colors are beautiful and they just literally melt and when I put them down it's there was like no like chunky powder left it's beautiful I'm gonna go ahead and do um, a few more swatches I'm showing you like different uh, shade of red they have I believe they have like three different shades of red they have the wine the orange red and the uh, pure red um, 
those are the three reds they have they have a few blues also and a few purples but they all different shade and you can clearly see, uh, see the difference in shade so which i think it's a great 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 variety of colors they have in the 24 shade that they offer now one thing that i want to make sure uh let you know guys that uh this products came uh, with 24 jaw in it and it's super super affordable i believe it's like between 25 or 29 dollars i'm not pretty sure but i leave the link for directly from the website um where you can find this product as well as you can check the amazon link as well that i have in the description box as well i will also link that in inside the amazon store as well but it's super affordable guys and trust me i was blown away blown away by the vibrancy of the color so which is like what we're going to be checking for i wanted to check uh you know all the claim they have on the back it's like vibrant and it's rich in colors it's like fade resistance it's not something that i can't choose uh, and, and tell you about right now because it's over time you'll see if the color kind of change so i'll let probably keep you update on that because i'll be using it i have like so much of them right now so i'll still be using them um and also the blendability is one key thing that i wanted to um sh um show guys if it's true or not because sometimes you'll be using maca powder and it's like take you so long to mix them into the epoxy and you still have like that chunky you know uh, powdery stuff that you have to mix and mix 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 so i wanted to make sure now i'm gonna go ahead and um just do like a test piece um to show you guys uh what the color is gonna come out to be if it's gonna be really rich and vibrant if it's gonna be blendable i'll stop and you know uh, um uh, most of this part is going to be sped up, but I will go ahead and put it in real time when I'm uh, mixing the color in to show you how it's blending it in the epoxy itself. So mixing uh, the color in the epoxy, it's going to be real time. Like I'm showing you right now, I'm taking like a decent amount of um, uh, uh, mica powder to put in my piece uh, because I wanted to give the color a chance because you know I wanted to give like a decent amount and this does the low spoon I'm using it's not even like a teaspoon it's very very tiny but the cups that i'm using all uh, all the guys i wanted to show you that the cups even though you have colors in it i, I reuse my cups all the time and but they are completely dry so the color is not gonna come off so i'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys in real time how i'm gonna mix the epoxy in the mica powder now as you can see it literally take me less than 15 seconds guys for the epoxy for the mica powder to melt into the epoxy it just melt into it like it's amazing like there was there was like no powdery residue it's such a good formula when it comes to melting into the epoxy i i don't know how to do soap or candle guys but i because it melts so much in the epoxy i wanted to go ahead and check to see maybe in the future i'll try to do like some soap or some like candle or anything to see if it's gonna stand the same way but as far as blendability uh or comes guys it's amazing i'm telling you right now you will be surprised to see how fast the maca powder is gonna melt into the epoxy so i give them a big a for blendability now i'm gonna go ahead and let you watch this part i'm just gonna spit up through it and make like a a, a piece a test piece to see what is gonna be uh, uh the color is gonna come out if they're gonna call um you know keep the same color that is in the box because so, sometimes you have a color that is showing inside the jar when you mix it in the epoxy and we put it down and it dry it's completely different so i'm gonna go ahead and let you watch this part guys and i'll be back to show you the final uh the final resort and we're gonna talk out you know our final verdict to see if it's a pass or if it's a fail so i'll see you in a bit guys
All right, guys, so we are back, and this is the next, 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 next day. It took me, like, four days to do the piece. You know, it's a geo that I like to do, like, in-depth, like, uh, layer on top of layer. And I was, like, blown away by the colors, guys. Beautiful. Simply stunning. Turning. After we put all our little, you know, line in it and do another coat of clay on it. Oh my God, I was like so impressed with the color. As you can see, I use like different shades of reds, but you can see clearly the difference between the shades. Oh my God, it's so, so beautiful. I absolutely love, love, love the formula of their Maca powder, guys. You need to give it a try. You need to give it a try, guys. Trust me. It is super affordable, guys. And it's a very impressive to say the least and guys i'll leave all the link for you in the description box below if you haven't done so please go ahead and subscribe to my channel like this video share it with your friend and family and guys that was it for today i will see you next week on another video and you know guys the drill as always be blessed and stay blessed i love you guys thank you bye